iRef Rhino 1.4 comes with a new powerful feature, the denoiser. In this example, we have the model of a synthesizer with some challenging rendering features like subsurface scatter materials that are being lit from the back. It takes quite a while until the image has reached a good image quality and as you can see on the buttons here there is still some noise left. So let's try out the new denoiser feature. We open the IRA settings window and under the options tab we go to the quality sections and we activate the denoise checkbox. The denoiser kicks in after the first few iterations have been gathered and removes the noise in the image that can be attributed to noise as a result of low iteration count. As you can see we get very smooth result on the subsurface scattered buttons and even though there are some artifacts that remind a little bit of JPEG compression we get a very good decent quality after just 200 iterations. Just for comparison when we had the original image after 200 iterations there would be a lot of noise left. So as you can see you can already estimate the look of your final rendering after a few seconds. The denoiser is also very well suited to improve the visual results when using the depth of field effect. So let's activate some depth of field and let's pick our focus distance and we'll try to focus on the button and we'll increase the depth of field effect. So without the denoiser it's the same thing. You see a lot of noise and it will take quite a while until the noise has resolved. So we are at about you know, 100, 150 iterations and you can see that there's a lot of noise left. Let's activate the denoiser and see how the result looks after the same amount of iterations. So already you see that you get very smooth results and we are about 60 iterations, 80, 100 and you can see that we have very smooth results now with most of the visible noise being removed. Here I have another example where we have an interior scene at night and interior scenes especially are very challenging for photorealistic rendering and the noise takes a while to resolve so you can see that we have after about 80 iterations quite a lot of noise going on and this will also take a while to resolve. So let's try the denoiser on this scene and as you can see just after a few iterations like 30 iterations we get a very smooth result and we can get a very accurate estimate of how the final rendering will look like. Here we are viewing the same scene from a different angle with the depth of field activated. Without the denoiser this render would take a long time to resolve. But once we activate it, we see that just after a few iterations the noise is being removed and we get much quicker an impression of what the final image will look like. Just after a few seconds of rendering having calculated about 40 iterations. If you want to learn more about our software, check the links in the video description below.